So the final thing we want to talk about in sampling with machine is using a sample to do some really cool sound design. Sound design meaning in this case that we're going to take a sample and kind of turn it into an instrument. Much like you would in a synthesizer using an oscillator to produce a sound, we're just going to use a random sample and make an instrument out of it. And I want to show you some cool ways that you can do this. So we are going to start by going to the disk tab and I've already taken the luxury to record a sound from Massive, a simple C note, and I just record this in Audio Hijack, and then it's sitting here on my desktop. Let's hear it. So what we're going to do is we're going to drag this in. Let's close out the browser, and let's turn on the sampling option. So you can see I just simply struck a Massive sound, and then hit the C note twice. And so what we want to do here is actually use the audio function, audio editing, to go in and kind of mess with this a little bit, turn this into an instrument. So first thing I want to do is truncate my audio. I'm going to go for the second section here. Let's only take this part. I'm going to hit truncate, and there we go. So now, you can see we have a nice start and end point here. Maybe we'll do it one more time. And really quickly, I want to go into the module and let's make this an ADSR envelope. So it's only going to play as long as I hold it down. So we come back in here, edit tab. Now we're going to basically normalize this. Remember, we can go in, just give it some nice sound. easier to work with, easier to see. 